YouTube, Poor Penmanship Planner here, coming at you with another video. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. And if this is your first time with me, welcome. <laughs> so I am super late on this Erin Condren seasonal surprise box thing. Um, I saw the one that was for the summer, but it was a little too yellow for me. So it wasn't something I was interested in. But this box being purple, and if you've watched any of my other videos, you know purple is my signature color. I cannot resist this box. And it happened to have some really good stuff inside of it. So I really wanted to order it. And luckily, Erin Condren came out with a limited supply um, of leftover boxes. So I was actually able to jump in and get one. Um, I actually broke my no spend for April uh, to get this box. So um, yeah, the whole no spend thing, I'm going to try again in May and maybe I'll be a little more successful. <laughs> so with that, let's take a look inside this box. First, again, gorgeous box. And I believe um, you can, it's reversible. So I believe there's some way that you can like turn it inside out and then make this part um, the outside of the box, which I won't do because I already keep enough stuff and I need to not keep any additional stuff. So that's that. So with that, let's uh, get this box out of the way and take a look at what is inside of this surprise box. Let me get this out of the way. Okay. A little better. Okay, so the Erin Condren Seasonal Surprise Box uh, comes with a vision journal coiled notebook uh, it's exclusive to the box meaning that it'll only come in this box and Erin Condren will not offer it um, on her website for sale uh, the value of this coiled notebook this vision journal is about $31 so this was something that I saw that really piqued my interest because um, I've never been one to get into like vision boarding or anything like that but I've kind of decided that since I've had this time with myself uh, during the stay at home order because of the COVID-19, I've had some time to do some reflection and I really do want to, you know, put some of my visions and my goals um, into moment, into movement. So that's what this would be for. So uh, it says the vision gets the dream started. And then it talks about, uh, welcome to your vision journal. What is vision boarding for those who don't know, which means I have to read that. <laughs> uh, it talks about write the vision and make it a plan. So getting started on creating your visit, vision and then helpful tools for vision journaling. Here it has some reflection pages, like what's happened in the past three, six, nine, 12 months. What I'm proud of in the past three, six, nine, 12 months, you circle the time period that you're looking for there. Uh, what would I like to improve on from the past three, six, nine, 12 months? What's happening in my life right now? What I like about what's happening in my life right now? What would I like to improve upon right now? Um, and then getting clarity is what I wanna focus on uh, with my vision or visions what I want to create with my vision or visions, and then what's important to me. And then it also has more information on getting started on creating your vision, putting your vision into words, making your vision a reality and important reminders, and then gives you some dot grid space here to do some brainstorming, a lot of brainstorming. So once you're out of the brainstorming section, um, it starts the, the vision part, create a vision that makes you want to jump out of the bed in the morning. So the way that this would work is here is where you would do your vision boarding. And then here is where you put words basically to that vision. So what the vision is for, when it was created um, or added to this, uh, what the vision means to you, and then plans and actions to bring the vision to life. And what I like about this is because most people have more than one vision is that this book is full of different ways and different visions that you can do. It's all, it's full of it. So you have a bunch of opportunities. And then once you've used all of those, you have like a lined 
a lined note, some line note pages in the back and some dot grid note pages in the back. So I'm really excited to um, get started with this vision journal. So I'm really excited about this. The next thing in the box would be this uh, ceramic planter. It has the Erin Condren signature circles on it. Uh, I do not have a green thumb. I kill succulents and those are really hard to kill, but I am so good at it. So I will probably not be putting a plant in this. Um, it may sit on my desk and I'll put pens or something in it, but I really shouldn't hurt plants by trying to plant one inside of here. So I probably won't do that, but it's really nice. It's got some good weight to it, it's very pretty. I'm sure I can find a use for it here on my desk. Um, next, there are some, oh, and that um, ceramic planner is exclusive again to the box, so it's not something that's gonna be for sale on her store uh, at her store. And then there are these cleaning checklist notepad. This is a sneak peek, meaning that um, this is something she's going to sell in her store, but she put it in her box, I mean, on her online. But this is something that uh, she put in the box, so it is a sneak peek. Uh, it gives you all the days of the week, a miscellaneous section, and then check boxes so you can plot out how much cleaning you're going to do. Um, it's pretty cute. I could probably use this because my cleaning is all over the place and it'd be good to have a schedule, so that would work. The next thing is a Wildflower Petite Journal with the productivity layout, and this is exclusive to the box as well, so it's not something that she'll be selling in her store or online. So let's take a look. It's very pretty. Very spring. Um, so it's just your let today be the start of something new. And it is in the productivity layout. So you have your lines and then you have like an area here where you can focus on things and then a line page on the back. Um, looks like it comes in a bunch of different colors on each page, which is really nice. Uh, I don't know if I have a need for another petite journal because I have like five of them, um, but I do have a friend I think who would really like this. So I will probably um, give this to her because she'll like it. So that is the petite journal that comes in the box which I think is super cute. Next, we have a do-it-yourself interchangeable pen kit. This again is a sneak peek. So let's take a look inside. Um, it has instructions on the back, how to enjoy. It comes with a fine tip, two highlighters, and a medium tip. And then you have the barrel, so. This would be the barrel of the pen. If you wanted to use the highlighters, which would be in lime and rose pink, you would be able to put either one on either side of this pen body. And now you have a two-sided highlighter. Or you can take that out, of course. And then you can use the fine tip, which is in cornflower, and the medium tip, which is in lilac. So that's what that looks like. And this is the fine tip. Kind of bummed that the fine tip is not the lilac, because I don't know how well I do with this thick of a a medium tip on a pen because I am the poor penmanship planner so that can be challenging but I think this is super cute and if it when it comes out I hope it comes out with additional colors or that you can buy so I can make something else out of that from a color perspective next we have a productivity washi tape duo which is an exclusive 
So it looks like there is washi tape here that has hours on it from uh, six, from 5 a.m. in the morning until 10 at night. So you can take this and put it down the side of uh, one of your planners and, and make hourly times on it. And then there's these boxer circles, which you can also put down and as you use as like check boxes or a list. So this is super cute. And they're two 16 feet rolls. So it's a lot on here. So not sure how much use I would get out of the hours because I don't really do things in an hourly perspective, but I really think I can use um, these uh, check boxes, check circles for lack of a better way to describe them. And then finally, looks like there is an exclusive uh, clear sticker sheet. And so it has some great color, bloom and grow. 20 minutes is all it takes. Let your dreams blossom. You are beautiful, capable and worthy. Some hourglasses, and super cute. So that is everything that came in the Erin Condren 2020 spring seasonal uh, surprise box. And again, what I was really excited about um, was this vision journal. I think right now having the time um, to spend at home <laughs> and reflecting is a good time for me to go ahead and put some, some feet on, uh, on my dreams or visions or goals basically that I'm gonna put in here. So I'm really excited about that. So I'm really happy I got uh, the box. I am super excited. It came with some really great stuff. Um, that I think um, I'll be able to use quite a bit of. So I'm super excited. And again, I know I'm really late to this party, but I'm in it now. <laughs> so. I hope you like this uh, unboxing of the Erin Condren seasonal surprise box. Uh, like I said, it is sold out. She did release some additional ones, um, but those sold out as well. So thank you guys for watching. If you could be so kind as to comment, like, subscribe, be greatly appreciated. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.